Hey, 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 welcome back to the channel. It's your man, Primetime, and you already know you're on Primetime Talk TV. And yeah, I'm back at you with another good video. And you already know the routine once you enter my house. Wipe your feet off, hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and smash the bell icon so you can be notified the next time I drop these next latest and greatest videos like these. For Primetime, to this day. Oh man, let's go ahead and jump on into this video, shall we? How about that fight between Clarissa Shields and Savannah Marshall? But it's a double header. It's a double header. You got Alicia Baumgartner versus Michaela Mayer. Oh man. Boy, oh boy, this is going to be a straight earth scorcher. The first, the first ever double header women's card pay per view with women heading up the whole entire event. Then you got champions, one going for undisputed and one going for unified. Dag on there, undisputed. If you ask me, you might as well say the way they both are looking, they look like two undisputed fights, the way these ladies are talking to each other. For real, I mean, a serious grudge match, a double header grudge match. <laughs> First I've ever seen with women boxers that got me this hype to see it. I mean, for real, for real. You talking about Alicia and Michaela going back and forth with each other. You talk about Clarissa Shield and Savannah Marshall going back and forth with each other. It's going down in the UK. I wish I was there. Oh my God, it is crazy. I am serious. So with these two matches right here kicking off this weekend, whew, mm, mm, mm. the O2 Arena, it can't get no bigger. It can't get no better than this for real and I mean it is a stacked weekend but I'm gonna split myself in three <laughs> places at one time or whatever get TVs laptop phones everything going I'm gonna see every last one of these fights I'm not gonna miss one of them for real because they all are too important they all are too important everyone want to see how Clarissa Shields is going to handle Savannah Marshall's power everybody want to see how Michaela's going to handle Alicia Baumgartner's power everybody want to see how Alicia Baumgartner going to handle Michaela's long reach and height and everybody want to see how Savannah Marshall handles Clarissa Shields power and barrage of shots and and punches that everybody is accustomed to because when she swarm T-Rex it is on I'm telling you so look this weekend right here is definitely the weekend you want to make sure you got your popcorn your chicken wings your burgers whatever you doing cooking on the grill or cooking it on the inside go ahead and get your menu ready go ahead and go to the grocery store get everything you need get your drinks your hors d'oeuvres your popcorn your candies whatever you dress up for your folks invite the family over invite your friends over and just have a good time because these fights are gonna be explosive for real I look it, it, I don't even have to sell these fights all you got to do is look at the press conferences look at the previews look at the clips read the headlines I'm telling you you already know this fight right here is of the highest proportions the best women in boxing going up against each other you rarely see that you rarely see champions want to get it on and want to take belts and the ladies are showing some of these men boxers how it's done some of these men champion that want to cherry pick everything and get everybody out of their own stable and their own camp let the best fight the best period no matter who it is no matter where it's from because you know what at the end of the day you're gonna get more respect by fighting the best of the best like these four ladies have chosen to do 
for real. I mean, a mega car. Then the undercar is stacked. So, you know, I mean, this this whole event is from front to back. So everybody, anybody that watches sports, that watches combat sports, that watches boxing, that watches MMA, you want to tune in to these ladies right here because I'm telling you, they are going to put on a barn burner for real. This is going to set the women's boxing landscape on a blaze from here from here on out i guarantee after this weekend everybody's gonna be talking about how the women fight was as good as not as better than some of the men pay-per-view championship fights even the lead up has been better to be honest with you these ladies right here have shown that wow they can you know take charge they can trailblaze they can do things that other boxers don't even fathom doing and that is one of the things that i love about these four ladies they all um have very very good amateur backgrounds some of them olympian champions this that and the third but they all are willing to put it on the line that's where you know it shows their paralysis as a champion that that's where it shows if they really have what it takes to really be in the history books because it's all about what you do in a career as a whole a totality of how you're looked upon in the hall of fame and things of that nature if you want to be talked about now if you want to just come and make your money and bounce i mean you know that's all good and dandy you know but with all that dedication with all that time with all those sacrifices to get to where you are you're supposed to want to be the best you're supposed to want to fight the best you're supposed to want to say at the end of the day look at my resume i fought the best of the best i beat the best of the best i stood there toe to toe i showed them who i was because i don't think no one gets into the boxing world or into the fight game to say i'm gonna be second best i'm gonna be third best i just want to you know fight some of the best no they go in it to be the best that's everyone's mentality so you know with these four ladies right here they have shown clarissa shield have shown that she is the best you know uh alicia barngarn has shown that she's one of the best michaela mayer has shown that she's one of the best you know savannah marshall has shown that she is one of the best they all deserve to be there at this moment at this particular time at this particular place getting it on in front of the world to show that women boxing is on the horizon it's right here it's right now it's in your face they are doing it and they can hold their own without men being on the undercard that's a good thing that's a good thing because honestly for a long time you know women boxing have been a footnote on the men's undercard boxing you know they have been an afterthought or a, a pre-fight now we have four beautiful women champions headlining their own pay-per-view event so you know if you got blood pumping through your bloodstream right now if you love anything about sacrifice about sports about giving it your all about overcoming the odds then you want to watch this fight right here because savannah marshall you know she got a win over clarissa shields in the amateurs the only one so she holding that, that little nugget over Clarissa Shield's head. We're going to see if Clarissa Shield has changed and evolved to the growth she is to be able to knock that nugget off. Or is it true that Savannah Marshall does just have the growth's number? We shall see this weekend. We're going to see. And we're going to see if Alicia Baumgartner can withstand Michaela Mayer, the Olympian champion, friend of the group. We're going to see if she can withstand the barrage of Alicia Baumgartner, that power she got in her power shots. We're going to see if somebody get KO'd and hit the mat. We're going to see which woman leaves with all the straps. And we're going to see who gets their hand raised at the end while the other one bows down to the queen. So with that being said, you know, look, 
you know what it is. You know what time it is. Get yourself together. Do not overlook this fight by a inch. Trust me. It's probably going to show up a lot of other fights this weekend as well. I think it's going to be as good as not um, better than some of the other fights that's going on this weekend. But it's so much good stuff going on this weekend. And this right here just adds to it. So you have no excuses saying that, oh, it ain't nothing going on this weekend. I'm going to be bored this weekend. You must be out your mind. It's so many pay-per-views, three or four, maybe more. But I tell you right here, this is the one you're going to want to see the encore. So with that being said, that's all I got for you in this video. You already know the routine when you leave my house. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, smash the bell icon so you can be notified the next time I drop these next latest and greatest videos here on Primetime Talk TV. And I'm on social media everywhere. Definitely go to the website, primetimetalktv.com and copy some merch. All right, y'all. Peace, love. I'm out till next time.